Hello, this is BJ Warren with Zen Toolworks, and welcome to another 3D printing tips and tricks. Today we're going to be going over filament tangling. Uh, filament tangling is a common issue that can happen every once in a while while you're 3D printing. Um, usually caused by uh, loose uh, filament, and the filament gets uh, wrapped underneath another wrap of filament, and eventually uh, leads to a printing failure. So one of the things you want to keep in mind is when starting off with printing, uh, you want to make sure to remove the end of the filament through the guide hole on the side of the spool and making sure to always keep tension in the filament. That's going to make sure that uh, the filament doesn't unravel on itself and, and come loose. Now if, it, if that does happen, and it does occasionally, occasionally the end of the filament will get caught underneath another wrap of filament. And after a while of printing, you may not notice it at first, but eventually you may get a stoppage in the print. Uh, you'll notice that maybe your, your extruder is not feeding plastic anymore. And if you look in the back, sometimes you might find what has happened is the filament is, is on a tangle. So there's a quick way to fix that. All you got to do is pull the filament off and feed, back feed a little bit of plastic filament through on the spool and then go ahead and take off a few wraps of filament from the side. Once you've done that, ensure that the tangle is now gone. Pull out a little, a few wraps, make sure it's, everything's moving smoothly, which mine is. Go ahead and re-roll those few wraps of filament back on the spool, and we're good to go. So either from here you can either put your spool back on the printer and keep going. Otherwise, if you're ready to store your filament, be sure to use the holes that are provided on the side of the spool. Wrap it through once and then back through the other. And that's going to ensure that your filament stays nice and tidy and it will not get tangled uh, while being stored. That's all for now and uh, hopefully that was a helpful piece of information and stay tuned and subscribe for more tips and tricks videos from Zen Toolworks.